My loves, you know how I am. This is Vladine. You know I'm all about spreading wisdom, spreading namaste, spreading positivity. So I found a quote to share with you guys from the Dalai Lama. Genuine and true human friends will always share your sorrow, your burdens, and will always come to you whether you are successful or unlucky. So the way to create such a friend is not through anger, not mere education, not mere intelligence, but by a heart, a good heart. Dala Lama. Namaste, my loves. But I have another spreading word, wisdom, spreading positivity and sharing it. What I wrote myself. This was inspired by, let me get this straight. My cousin Regine's husband is a podcaster and he has his podcast is Awaken the Awesome. So we're all about Olivier Day. Now, he his topic was the importance of physical activity. So he sent it to me and I said, you know what I sent back to him? In life, what's important is to start the oxygen first and then share it with others. Just like being fabulous. It starts with you first and then you share it with others or you inspire others. Okay, my loves, did you catch that? Fabulous first and then you inspire others and you share, you inspire others and they will be fabulous also. But I, my philosophy in life presently is keep your mind awake, keep your mind nourished because it's a jungle out there. Keep your soul shining, keep your heart filled with love. Namaste. So one last time, my loves, just in case you didn't get it. Keep your mind awake. Keep your mind nourishing. Keep your soul shining. And keep your heart filled with love. Namaste, my loves. Hi, my loves. Here I am, Vladine. You're already team Vladine. But here we're going to be supporting also a fabulous person also. Team Sophia Pauline Baluk. How are you today? I'm good. I'm happy to be here. Oh, she's so kind. She's so kind. Anyways, you can always go on my Facebook and see some of her pictures and also on her work, but we'll talk about that later. Let's start very slow on the basics. She is a photographer who has dabbed into the artwork, uh, fashion world, and real estate world. So let's start basic here. How did you get into the photography world? Basically, it was actually... A while ago, it was back in Morocco. Oh! Because <laughs> I used to live in Morocco, remember? I love, I love Morocco. Morocco, where in Morocco? In Casablanca, actually. Oh, I, I love it. In the beach, in oh. the sand, you know, which is completely different from yes. here, right? Yes, 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 you know, yes. there we have a storm of snow. <laughs> uh, I mean, here we have snow, storm of snow, there they have storm of scent. Yes, oh, so, that anyways, is so good. I know. And I like Marrakech so, also and uh, Rabat. Yes, you've done them all. Well, I used to study in, um, in Rabat, actually. Oh, yes, yeah, which is the capital of Morocco. Oh, okay. And uh, yeah, it's beautiful. Marrakech is one of, actually, one of the be most beautiful cities in the world, I guess. I we call go it, back any time. We call it the red city, actually. Everything oh. is red. Oh, all the houses, all the streets, everything is red. Well, you learn something every day, my love. <laughs> exactly. So anyways, um, in Morocco, I yeah. was doing a horseback riding. Oh, actually, fun story. And uh, I used to do a lot of competitions and everything. Oh, okay. And I sold my horse to buy a camera because oh, I was. That's old. money. I was always interested about it. I never tried it on, and I saw friends who have many cameras. But anyways, so that I so I sold my camera. I have one, uh -huh. and I tried it on with just the basics, you know, just to get okay. in touch with it. It was nice. I learned the basics, and um, when I got to Montreal now. Okay. I was studying uh, communication where you have courses of, yes. uh, you know, cinema yes. and photography and, everyth uh, and everything. So there I had the opportunity to learn more about it. So there you go. I think this is how I get in touch with it, with the photography. <laughs> photography world. But uh, myself, I am Team Sophia Pauline Balouk. But I also love the photographer Annie Lubevitch. And she has a book out right now that if people want to get it for me, I'll be fine. But I'll get it myself also. Annie Lubevitch. Portraits 2005 2016, where she has done a lot of her work for Vogue magazine and also, yes, and also a Vanity Fair. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's my photographer, but who's the photographer that has inspired you? You know, there is this uh, Montrealer photographer, she's uh, Darian Sanchez. I don't know how she's not that recognized yet. Well, now you're putting her out there to my love. She's amazing. And when you talk to her, she's very humble and everything. 
and uh, she's doing a Vogue photo shoot. And yes, yeah, she's big. She's big, but she's she's, she's big. Everybody, my loves. She's, she's big. She's a Montrealer, and she's doing fabulous work without not with such a small space she can do a lot like a lot of like a lot of emotions in her pictures oh, that's anyways Darian Sanchez okay you heard that team her name again <laughs> Darian Sanchez okay you see how we support others also and name a picture that you thought was beautiful that you always remembered that you didn't shoot of course <laughs> I think this is the picture um Everybody saw it from uh, National Geography. You know oh, this girl, yes. this Indian girl? She has, I think, um, green eyes. Yes. She's looking like this. Beautiful. You know, eh? Beautiful, yes. It's one of the best pictures. Yeah. I think uh, it's rated one of the best pictures in the world. Yes. You know, and uh, well, very many awards, I believe. Right? Yes, I mean, yes. We don't want to give fake news, but that's the word is uh, Steve McCurry who did the picture. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Of the best. One of the best. Speechless, speechless. And you have dabbed into the art world, fashion world, and real estate world. So on that, which was your most memorable photo shoot? Other than the one you took of me, of yes, course. Oh, God. Way, she was fantastic <laughs> shooting with her. She's always beautiful in every picture. Vladi, anyway. Oh, thank you, thank you. Uh, but we'll talk about somebody else first. Yes, okay. All right. Um, Actually, it was this summer. Funny enough, he was a new client, a new a new broker that I have, okay. and uh, we were on San Bruno. Okay. He told me, "Okay, wait, Sofia, just come. We're going to shoot like a a, a, me, a big house. It's bigger than normal, but just don't make a, a lot of things. Just come, just come." Okay, I went there. Simple. It was like a castle, a huge mansion. I, I th I'm so excited just I, hearing. I thought this. it was it was a hotel, but just two person were living there. This was beautiful. You will love it. A, ca a castle, a big, you know, like a Gatsby style. Oh my! No, a huge. Um, oh, everything was big. Okay, think big. Speechless. Yes, yeah, speechless. Exactly. Oh and my. I spent there. Um, it was 3 p.m. to. Uh, we spent the night there to take photo shoots uh, by night. So usually, you're quick on your photo shoots, but I this you purposely that. did that though. We, we, we've been there all the whole time anyway it was amazing oh, amazing great beautiful i know that you left the bureaucracy world and you're like i can't do this anymore you decided to enter here and do your own business congratulations <laughs> congratulations <gasps> oh <Not> my <laughs> tell the truth tell the truth what made you decide i can't do this anymore i've got to do my own business you know all the busy schedules that somebody puts you you have to be here at this hour this at this i hate this i've always <laughs> been an, an independent <laughs> person you know i like to do my own schedule I like to be you know like my own boss you know okay. deal with which person i want to deal with I don't want to be forced to do something. Oh, you're meant, you're meant to be a leader then. Maybe. You know what? Th my dad used always to say to me like that. So maybe you're right. <laughs> and how does it feel having your own business? Well, how does it feel? Of, of course, it's nice. But like I said, it's always look nice. But it's a 24-hour job. Twenty. You have a lot of competition. First of it. Okay. So, I mean, when you're sleeping, somebody is working, you know? Oh. You know, this is that, that type of mind that you have to have. It's like a little bit. That's a great wisdom sure. moment. A little bit, oh. you know? So it's not one big happy family in the photography world. It's more competitive. Tell me and my yes, loves the yes. truth. There is a lot of competition. And uh, sometimes, you know, uh, photographers are cutting, you know, prices, stealing manda from sitting contracts. So you have to be, you know, uh, you have to show that you're better. You know, it's competitive in all the ways, you know. But I think you, you work ethic and it makes you, your branding also makes you, you know, different from everybody. So there's a balance that you have to find, you know. Oh, well, that is one. Thank you for sharing the truth with me and my loves. The okay. Truth, but, uh, you know, by every day, it's so beautiful what I do. I take pictures of beautiful houses. This is, I think, you know, I woke up in the morning. Okay, I have five shoots today. Three houses, two condos, and beautiful condos, you know, because it's luxurious. Anyways, nice, nice. There is and, a <laughs> and you definitely, this, you just felt this is for you. Naturally. Naturally. naturally and I like for the photography of course I like the business also of it this is why I wanted to start my own business to be first an entrepreneur to do my things and so you have the business talent 
and the art talent. Yes, okay. this is a great combination. Yes. When you can, you know, mix your passion with your work, with the business, and to be completely, you know, all, uh, nothing too hard or something, this is the best. I'm happy to. Let's get back to the photography world. Let's leave the business world alone for a second. But um, preference, black and white pictures or colored? When do you use black well, and white? When do you use colored pictures? You're asking me in the real estate or everything? You talk know. to us, talk to me and my love. What I like in portraits, uh, especially the, the, the woman that I, that I mentioned earlier, yes. Darian Sanchez, she's doing black and white with a grain, um, with noise, you know, in the picture. This is beautiful. I love black and white yes. for the portraits. I have to say. But you know, like me for real estate, the colors are the best. You have to show the colors, you have to show what flowers yes. they, they have to show the wall, you have to show the woods. I have to show everything. So colors, I would say for uh, paysage, you know, okay. landscapes, yeah, okay, everything. Okay, okay. Nature. Nature, nature, yes. Also animals, I think. But uh, <laughs> for portraits, uh, I would do black and white for sure. Ah, that yes. is good. And speaking of, we're still on the photography world. Which which one is it? Art, fashion, or real estate? Which one's your preference? What do you think? <laughs> I think real estate's the money, oh. but the fashion, the art, is your uh, look. I like the fashion, uh, the, the, um, the Vogue magazines, the fashions. But I would say I love architecture. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Yes. There is so many, I don't know, uh, moves, spaces that you can take in pictures. I love real estate and architecture, I would say. more oh, Great than, balance. Yes, yes. More than, um, than shooting person in pictures, actually. Okay. Yes, I would say. That's your thing. That's your I, thing. I feel Ah, <laughs> and speaking of that, uh, for people to be Team Sophia Pauline Balouk, when they hire you, what do they get? Well, they put your brand out there, right? They get, I think, uh, the f you know, I'm cool to work with, okay. You know, That's of true. course, very That's professional, exactly. uh, timely, uh, work ethic is what you were speaking about ethic. before, of course. I think this is one of my my uh, bis big uh, strength, you know. Okay. Uh, I work hard and you can see it in the picture. The pictures are beautiful. This is why people are calling me back because the pictures are unbelievable. Speechless. You know, so this I do professional stuff. So it's coming back. I mean, anyways. Everything comes back when right. it's good. When it's good. And uh, that's pretty it, yes. Oh, good. And okay, so how can people, my loves, if they know anybody, can get in touch with you? Well, through, of course, my, all my social media platforms, uh, website, Instagram. I don't know, Facebook, anywhere. Okay. You're welcome. <laughs> She's in the social media world. <laughs> exactly. But so far, you know, clients are, um, uh, you know, calling. Uh, reference. Yes, reference. Yeah, reference. When somebody needs somebody, yeah. it's, uh, you know. Somebody um, knows somebody. Yes, it's uh, mouth. Uh, you know, yeah. Everybody is oh, speaking. So anyway. Because you're good at what you do. Let's be truthful. So one last thing. What was the last picture shoot you took? Other than myself. Um, it was yesterday, it was yesterday I did, uh, actually it was just after Christmas so it was back to work. <laughs> it was nice because I it was too beautiful penthouse, uh, yes, um, I did Icon in um, downtown of Montreal, uh, beautiful, staged, so beautiful furniture, a lot of woods, a lot of metal. It's beautiful. Oh my. So uh, two two penthouse, and uh, so far now I'm having the holidays off. Oh, good. Good, 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 right? good. Do you need that? Do you need that? Do you need that? Or I don't know. Oh, nice, nice, <laughs> nice. Know. You're balancing it right, right? And um, yeah, so far January looks pretty almost booked so oh, far that's good. did you hear that yeah. she's almost booked for january so get on on it so team again my love sophia pauline baluk and again just say one last time how people can get in touch with you of course for my websites uh you can find it at www hold on <laughs> www that's all right we're going live yes? okay going live dot com uh no no <laughs> www this is the fun part we're doing it live so your website is www.sofiapolinbalouk.com great and you said other places they can find you also on instagram this is so yes on facebook sofia pauline Baluk. you can so read just google her. her and you are going to find her so my loves namaste and keep in mind team vladin and team sofia pauline Baluk. namaste my loves
Hi, my loves. It's Vladeen, Team Vladeen. And also, don't forget to support. Here's Team Sophia Pauline Balou. So we're just going to have a little girl talk, support you guys, and also get to know each other. I'm such a restaurant woman. My loves know that. What was the last restaurant you ever you went to? I went to Kazoo. Uh, down oh, Montreal. you're teaching me something I don't know. Kazoo. Foods. One of the best foods you can ever eat, I think. Huge portion. If you're a vegetarian, I don't know, meat lover, you will love this place. It's full of vegetables. You have to. I've heard about it, but yes, I've never gone. What did you have? I had the vit the vegetarian vegetarian. Okay. Bowl. Vege vegetarian. It was it was a complete everything complete. I think I added more chicken. But, okay, uh, <laughs> okay, but delicious. <laughs> delicious. Ah. Delicious. Yeah, beautiful sauce ah. and everything. Yeah, you should try. Good. My last restaurant was. Do you know the restaurant Bivo in the old port? No. 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 <gasps> you need to go. Great music. The pasta. The best. Exactly. That was the last one I went. I went with the actress Coco Galore. So please support her too. Just Google. Everybody, you just Google. And the <laughs> same day, I went also to the restaurant. Let me say right. Bocata. And that one is in the old port. Great food. Great pasta. Great ambiance. You haven't been to that one? There's another one to add to the list. Add to the list. So <laughs> Team Bevo, Team Bocata, and Kazoo. Kazoo. Exactly. Last makeup you bought. I'm not a makeup lover, I would I'm say. Not, so, you know? what was the last one? I think it was my mascara. I think oh. I have it uh, for one year ago, so I changed oh. it, I guess. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no makeup which, lover. Which designer? Which uh, you? I would, say, I would stick with L'Oreal. Oh yes, yes, yes. So you can't go wrong. For me, right? You can't. Can. Simple basics. So uh, yeah. You can't go wrong. Mine is today's look, uh, Giorgio Armani. Oh. I. <laughs> look at you. <laughs> <laughs> Georgia Armani I love because uh, back in the days they had Megan Fox and I have always said oh, if yes. I have to come back on the planet not looking like me Megan as fabulous I'd be fine with Megan Fox. Do you know what? who Megan Fox is? Of course I exactly. know Megan Fox. No, you got to ask people. Beautiful. She's gorgeous, but she's no she's longer. Uh, now they have for the perfume um Kate Blanchett. You, I know her. Team? Yes, Kate yes, Blanchett, yes. great actress and everything. Yeah. But Georgia Armani, and for those who want to get your makeup done, Georgia Armani, go to I want to say her name right again, Habanon, Habanon. So please go see her. But we're talking about designers. Last designer you purchased? It was a Montreal designer, oh. uh, a bag, uh, oh. M O eight five one. Oh yes, 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 yes. Their leather is very good. Whole made in Montreal, yes. handmade. It. Yes. Uh, oh, supporting quality. your Canadian. Beautiful quality, very practical, very fashionable, versatile. Yes. Uh, yes. Oh, what color? I think, but, well, this is my gray right there. Ah, yeah, so every gray, gray is a My gray camera, gray. lenses, battery up. It does go. business. Yes. Oh, yes. perfect. Looks perfect. good and uh, comfortable. And classic. And, yeah, classic. They're, they're very known do, for classic. You know, sport chic? Yes. This is my style. Yes, yes. You I'm like working, you, you know? like comfort. Comforts, but uh, chic also, yes, you know? Yes, yes, yes. It's a little touch of quelque chose. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I have to say the last designer I got was Gucci. I'm such a team Gucci. It's so popular oh, right oh, now. Oh, oh. Exactly. Is okay. The new design that they have now? Alexandro Michaele. Oh. Team Gucci, we are both Team beau. Gucci. Exactly. Beau. Look at her. C'est très beau. C'est très beau. C'est très beau. Exactly. You can go. What's good about Gucci, there's something for a classic, but there's also a bit. I mean, there's nothing to say. Gucci. No, there's no, mean, nothing. Gucci has been here for so, so exactly. long. Exactly. But it's hot I since mean, the new designer. You are so right about that. Exactly. Last trip you booked that you went to? Oh, I went to Cuba. Like, <gasps> Was the last <gasps> trip with, uh, where in Cuba? In Cuba, in um, Camagüey. Oh, where's that? It's the opposite of Havana. Okay. And uh, it was a last minute trip, four days. I haven't gone away from Canada uh, two years. Oh, I was my. Working, working for, you know, oh, my. for my entrepreneurs to work well for ah, my business. You sacrificed. So, yes. So two years uh, on. So I took four days off and it was oh. worth it. And what and was the charm of Cuba for you? You know, just the hot weather, you know, oh. first of it because we're living in Canada, right? So, yes, 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 <laughs> of so course. Uh, but of course, um, 
the food is something you know to to uh, how can I say, how can we say it you know you have to taste the food to to really you know know what it's about but I would say the landscapes okay. uh, the people are so great that's what they say the music, music the yes no, oh, I, mean, I mean I mean everything so you're saying that you would go back to Cuba I would go back I would go right, back uh, maybe next trip uh, I'm taking Panama Oh, uh, that's Sarica, nice. Maybe. I hear the, the tourism in the last few years have been extraordinary. Right. Many people want to go to Costa Rica. Now. Exactly. Yeah. So that's the next one. Maybe. For well, sure. On my side, I stayed in America. Okay. Boston was my last trip. And I will say, I know, beautiful. Oh, have you gone to Cheesecake Factory? No. <gasps> Best pumpkin pie really? ever with the whipped cream. Are you a pumpkin pie lover? <sighs> it's got to be with the whipped cream, though. A whipped cream. And the thing about uh, Cheesecake Factory, you get there. You see your dessert? Okay. <laughs> There's many, there's many. Okay, okay. And then what happens is you see your dessert. I don't know if my loves, will you do the same thing? You see the desserts. You're like, okay, I'm going to take this. Once you've had your main course and your entree, you're so full, you forget about the dessert. But this really? time I stuck in there and I had my <laughs> pumpkin pie. I shared, I shared, but it was so good. Such, uh, it was so good. So t Boston, Team Boston, Cheesecake, Cheesecake Factory, and pumpkin pie. I love Boston. Exactly. And last TV show. Watched. Well, um, I'm just doing a Breaking Bad review. I, I, I watched the whole. People the whole love that show. It's very nice. It's very nice. And you're watching a second time, you understand even more the things. <laughs> so, anyway, very nice. But it's over, though. It's over. Okay, but so I'm, I'm re watching it with <laughs> my boyfriend. Yes. And the last one that I saw, which is new, is. Um, Game of Thrones, of course. Lots of people love that one. Did you love it? Do I'm you not watch a Game it? of Thrones lover, no. but I hear it's excellent. My oh son. my I have god! A, I have lots of friends that love it, and the writing and everything. But it's what season? Oh, it's the end. No, there is another season that coming up uh, actually this summer, I okay. think. Okay. And uh, so yeah, it's still it's, going on. It's still going on, it's and I think they're putting like one month in a year. You know, okay. like we have, we have like eight episodes, and that's it. You know, it's, and we have, we want more. You know, and we, we have to wait another no, year. No, to people continue. love, love it. I have to say, I'm a real Housewives of Beverly ah, Hills fan. Okay, I love it. just like TV, and I am a Team Erica Jane fan. Exactly. Are you any Real Housewives? That's not your thing. You're really a Netflix girl, I, deep writing and all that. That's it. You got it. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> Last movie you saw. Um. Last movie I saw, oh, was in the theater. Okay. Mother, have you seen Who it? Who stars in that one? What's uh, Jennifer Bell? Lawrence and um, the, the the guy from. Uh, oh yes, yes, yes. Javier, the one married to Penelope exactly. Cruz. I he's, see his face, isn't it? Javier Bardem. Yes, yes, yes. He handsome. has sex he's appeal. Exactly. Go, go, wow. Great job, Penelope wow. Cruz. Yes, but she's yes. beautiful well, also. She's beautiful. Yeah, also, yeah. I Team mean, Penelope this is Cruz. A great balance. And, and how was that movie? movie? You know when you go out of the theater, the, of the theater yeah. and you don't speak for two hours next, no? Because you're that absorbing one, like, everything, yes, analyzing how it. the movie was good, and oh uh, it was amazing. Because he's a great actor. He's a great actor, and she's a great actor. And she's doing script, very well for herself. The script is amazing. This is, uh, you know, it's. I feel like it's been so long that I haven't watched a good movie like this. Oh my! You have to watch it. Oh my! Everybody the, has to watch oh it. My, oh yeah, my! Oh yeah, my! Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> she has goosebumps. She has. Goosebumps. <laughs> I like movies. So I, much I'm much like you. Yeah. I love my movies, but I haven't been to the movies in a while because I'm very picky about my movies. If okay. I'm going to waste my time, I have okay. to go there. <laughs> so I'm going to say the last movie I saw was on TV. It was, it's light, light, the bounce back, and it stars my crush, Shamar Moore. When God created Shamar Moore, he made no mistake physically, okay? Right. No, no. So, but it was a light movie, and I love those movies about relationships, love, and Shamar Moore was in it. You're romantic. Yes, that's it. You must say, you must say. So, do you know Shamar Moore? Is that one of your crushes? Of course, of course. Oh, he is? Oh, because, you know, I wanted to be friends with you. I thought, I thought you'd give it to me. Exactly. Shamar Moore, keep in mind, I said your name first, okay? Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Yoga. Xavier, you know? Oh. The one from uh, from Mother that I told you. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Okay. yes. Oh, you like man. He's a man. Yes, yes, yes. That's a très acceptable. Very acceptable. <laughs> Very the, the, and the last award show you went to or you saw on TV? Which one did I? What was the last one I saw? 
Um, I don't remember. Which one did you see? The last one I saw was Young M.A. I'm a hip hop lover. And um, also the last one I saw on TV was um, the Soul Train Awards with Erica Badu. She was excellent. And Tony Braxton. <laughs> Team Tony Braxton, Team Erica Badu, Team Young Emmy, and you? It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a while. And um, I, I love watching those shows. Yes, when, exactly. When it comes to me, and I think the last that I saw was when Leonardo DiCaprio has his first Oscar. Okay, now we're going way back. He's he's he he's we're going way back because he's he's um, he's done a few movies since. Okay. <laughs> Well, which one? Oh, but it's true. He, no. he won his Oscar, but he should have won many Oscars. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Remember, it was his yeah, first yeah, Oscar. Yeah, yeah, yes, exactly. That is true. What? Are we haven't, I haven't seen him in a while. Is he I doing know, anything I specifically? Know. He's not here. Yeah, okay, okay, that's okay. Because I just want to hang with him. Okay, no? <laughs> yeah, that's your crush. He can be your crush. I just want to be that he's my friend. That's okay. all. Okay, so we're okay with the crushes. Uh, what song are you playing over and over again? Ah oh, no, I'm really into like this deep, um, not house uh, and R and B and the um, Magic Jordan. They are from Toronto. They're so good. Oh, um, okay. Some, yes, and Drake. I think uh, just Drake. Like, oh, okay. I'm Team uh, Drake. Okay, been to his concert. Love it. Sign with them. Okay, and it's so mixed, they're good. Um, yes, yes, really good. They're mixed with Flume. Do you know Flume? No, you're teaching me something. Oh my God! Oh, yeah, there's a, uh, a great mix uh, with the house music and the uh, R&B and rap. This is a oh, good mix. You would like a, it, for sure. Hey, oh, I just hear Drake sign them, so that's right it, there, I know everything's go. good. Yeah. Exactly. On my side, I, I have a few because I love music. Be we talked about Ca Canada with Drake. Well, I Belly the rapper, man, listen, excellent. Team Belly. Also. My the beehives, you can like us or at least me, cause I am Team Beyonce with "Hold Up" is my favorite song from Beyonce, and "Mi Gente" with um, featuring G Balvin, Willie William. But like you said, I'm a hopeless romantic. My last song that I cannot stop playing is Ed Sheeran, "Perfect." Oh, <laughs> and I'll add "Shape of You" also. Ed Sheeran, Team Ed Sheeran. Oh, okay. I gave at the beginning my philosophy, which was very um, keep your mind awake, keep your mind nourished, keep your soul shining, and keep your heart filled with love. Namaste, my loves. What's your philosophy and wisdom? I would say um, it would be all about um, work ethic. The more you're going to work, um, the more, you know, uh, I think valuable you're going to be. Oh, so okay. the more you work, the more you're going to be, I think, for me, because I'm a worker. I, a workaholic? Yes, really. Yeah. So uh, I don't have this one. Um, no, but you, you say your thing is to always work hard and the rewards will come back to you. Yes, exactly. Exactly. No, yes. no, no, no. That is excellent. Great. You heard that? That's her wisdom and philosophy. Listen, good wisdom. Oh, okay. Good wisdom. Really? Yeah. <laughs> wake up uh, early in the, mo in in the, the morning, morning and it's everything's like, going to get done. You usually do your best work early in the morning or you're a late owl? A uh, night owl. Pardon me, night owl. Um, I'm a morning person. Morning person. Okay, that's yeah, why yeah, they yeah. would do. No, I, I, like, I like to talk what about What do you mean friends. morning? Morning person. Like what? Six in the morning? Okay. Five in the morning? No, like eight in the morning. Okay, yeah, yeah. I'm like eight. Eight, 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 eight I mean, I think it's a morning person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you're right. You know, you're right. Just, I'm working from home, right? Okay. So. I can speak with my clients, I have my pyjamas on, okay. you know, and oh. he doesn't know. He <laughs> That's the best nice. thing about having your own business. Yes, yes, it's nice. That is it's definitely nice. the it's nice. best thing. Nice. Like we're speaking of wisdom and nourishing the mind, what was the last book you read? Um, I'm really into uh, self-motivation now. Oh, okay. So I'm reading this book now, which uh, from uh, Napoleon Hill, um, Thick and Grow Rich. Oh, <laughs> I, I like, like the rich part. I love the rich part. Rich <laughs> inside, rich <laughs> out. Exactly. Um, yes, and it's uh, just help you to make your goals, uh, to think straight. When sometimes focus. Have, yes, to keep the focus. When sometimes you have. A little bit down, you know, it happens, yes. you know, challenges, you cannot, obstacles, cannot always be a hundred percent. So yeah. it's always, I don't know, it's a great book. Actually, oh, if somebody okay. feels down, you can read this book. And maybe if you want to start something, a business, on own, okay. yeah, this is a great book that I recommend. Oh, okay. With the name again? Um, Think and Go Rich uh, by Napoleon Hill. Oh, very good. Well, I'm on so this, good. I'm on the same theme with you. Very My good. last book I got for my sister Joelle was The Wisdom of Sunday, 
Team Oprah Winfrey. Okay, <laughs> it's like it has like so much wisdom in it that you know already. Mm -hmm. Or just a reminder. Exactly. We're so team Oprah. Mm -hmm. Okay. You need to like, there's God and then there's Oprah. <laughs> exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And okay. So if you came back on the planet physically as a celebrity, it couldn't be you because you're gorgeous. But, but the fact is the universe said no. Who would you, who would you want to look like? Which celebrity? That's a great question, actually. Let me think about it. I already said Megan Fox, but I have another one. Yaha Sha Shahidi. She's on the show. She's an actress on the show Blackish, and she's going to be on um, Crownish. So you're going to Google that one. And then, who's? You know Lupita? What does that mean, Belle? That means Belle. Um, Lupita, uh, what Lupita, is. Lupita, why do I know Lupita? Oh, yes! yes she's you know on the cover of Vogue for Wait, December, January. Let's talk about this she's woman. Star she's... Wars. Uh, is it Star Wars? No, no, no. no. She, she's uh, doing the um, 50 years of. Uh, the, the slave one yes. movie. Yes, 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 yes. yes. And she such class. Is such a classy woman. Yes. Beautiful. And I don't know, I wish every woman could look like that. Yes, you know? Yes, 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 uh, yes, I respect yes, her yes. so much. And uh, she's yeah. young. She's very young and she's doing so much. I mean, I, I really she like She's fabulous on the red carpet. This is like my example of oh, women. beauty. Yes. Oh, yes. my. Yes. And now that we're speaking of women, we must not forget about the men. Now, who's your male crush? I already told you Shamar Moore, and you feel like you want to take Shamar Moore <laughs> away from me, but whatever. Okay. What do you think? Who it is? I, t I told you. Really. Leo DiCaprio. So we're okay. We could have like dinner. This. I'm with Shamar, and you're with Leo. Oh, so we're okay, because he's... He's still single. Well, he's not married. He's That's just it. No, no. Uh, nice. What's wrong with that girl? No, <laughs> no, no, no. Actually, he's better, right? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. He's of age now. <laughs> exactly. So, anyways, now it must stay my loves. That was a little recap of great restaurants, great music, and great movies. So, namaste, my loves. And again, we want to be Team Vladine, but also to be Team Sophia. Pauline Balouk. First of all, when they hire you, what do they get? What do they what? What do they get when they hire you? Uh, what work ethics? Of you course, of course. Yeah, yeah, yes. A great um, work ethic. Um, you know, ambitions. You know, I'm young. I'm, I'm 22. Oh. So uh, I'm fabulous. I, I do a lot of things for my age. I okay. think so. You know, when you, I, I think uh, I'm young. I can do like so much things. You know, so. Of course, my work ethic, my pro the main thing. Exactly. Pro professional, of course. Yeah, professional, exactly. And let's just say again how they can get in touch with you. With my website and through social media, Google Sofia Pauline Balouk. There you go. My loves, namaste, namaste, namaste. Okay, okay. My loves, my loves, my loves, my loves, my loves. How are you? Again, this is Vladine. And also, we are here again to support Team Sophia Pauline Balou. So, we're just going to do a little hot topics here. Who's in? And see if uh, she's team that person. Is she going to join on my loves with the team aspect? The first person is... Are you ready? Because uh, I'm a real housewife kind of woman now. The Kardashians. Exactly. Are you Team Kardashians? Do you have a favorite? What if I'm not a real team? That's all right. That's all right. Because I'm a Team Kardashian woman. That's all right. That's how we get along. I'll hang with them and you stay at home. Okay. Exactly. But wow. I'm a Kardashian. I do. I think they did a great job. No, I really honestly, the mother did a great job by keeping them popular. You can't deny yeah. their popularity after all uh, these years exactly. and making all that money after all these years. So I, I applaud them on well, that. Well, uh, what, what's her name? Chris Jenner? Yes, Chris Jenner. That's well, she, who I She's She is the real uh, businesswoman. Yes. yes, that's right. And you're a businesswoman too, which so you have to applaud. I, I mean, she, she is great. Yeah. And also all her kids are doing this. I mean, they're yeah, you so did well. the Makeup line, Kim did, uh, Kylie also this year. And next year, they're going to be very popular. Everybody's almost pregnant. There's Kim, there's Kylie, there's really? Chloe. Yeah, they're all three they honestly you have to give them on the business aspect oh no no exactly. of course, and the of show course, and everything of but just i think uh, kim is doing like how many things yes yeah, uh, uh, jack I mean. of all trades exactly i i can have i see myself hanging with kim kardashian yeah. but all of them if they want to hang with me i'm fine with that so tim uh, team kim kim Karda uh, kardashian another one are you team oprah winfrey of course 
Paris. Okay, well, you of course. Some people you know out there. What? I, I okay. would love to spend a day with her. I would oh my, just put it out in the universe. Put it out there. Just with her, just think about everything. Yeah. So, just so she can reconfort me, you know. Oh, and, Mama oh. Oprah. Yes. Mama, Mama Oprah. Oprah. Yes. Exactly, yes. exactly. I have oh. to say, I am Team Oprah Winfrey, as I had previously mentioned uh, the book, The Wisdom of Sunday, that my sister got me, which is excellent. Also, the first magazine I got for January 2018, Oprah, and her network I do support with the show Greenleaf. So I'm a Team Oprah, okay? Team Oprah, Team Oprah, <laughs> team Oprah okay? Um, are you a Team John Travolta? I like him. Yes, 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 yes. He's a great actor. That's why, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oscar. Um, he's about to be in a movie of a mobster, alleged. I don't want to have problems with people, alleged. Uh, John Gotti. So I can't wait to see that because he's a great actor. I really think he's a great actor. Also, um, this is what, are you team Yahara Shahidi? This is the woman I said, if I came back on the planet looking like not me, I'd be fine looking like her. She's on the show Gro uh, Grownish. No, she's about to be on the show Grownish. Okay. And but she's right now the show Blackish. It's a great show. You don't know. You're gonna Google her. We're gonna Google her. See, Yahara Shadidi. I got you a newbie. Okay, a newbie who's gonna support you. Exactly. Somebody's gonna Google her. Exactly. Are you Team Beyonce? This is very popular for me, Beyonce. You okay, know. Be careful of the beehives. They are serious. Into into her. Um. No, she's beautiful. She's a beautiful woman. She's talented. Keep it positive. You know I'm more of a fan of the Beyonce. Um, the before. Oh, uh, no, during no. Destiny Child? No, when oh. she was doing. Um, when she was just coming out solo? Yes. Oh, yes. that's interesting. The old school Beyonce. Okay. I'm not a fan of now. Okay, now. okay, okay, okay. The more popular song, I'm not a okay. huge fan of it. Okay, you know? okay. But when she was uh, before Adelaide, like the song Halo. Um, okay, yes, okay, I see. This is like, that was your. Uh, yes, I can okay. listen to those songs every, oh every time. I mean, not now, no, this is not my, my vibe. Okay, okay, okay. Like okay. I lost her, but okay. I'm not. Yeah, she said Beyonce. Exactly, exactly. And oh, that, that song, Hello, that there was another crush of mine, Michael Ely. Google him too because he is definitely another crush of mine. But Beyonce, I am Team Beyonce. Hold Up's my favorite song. And also, me hinted the, the money, what I got, it's from Puerto Rico. Um, it puts Puerto Rico in perspective, so which is very good for uh, with what's happening. Uh, I mean, we're sending them all positive energy. Me uh, hinted is J Balvin, Will, Willie Willie. William also features in that song. And are you Team Rihanna then? I would say this is the same thing. I'm sorry. No, I'm so right, Because as long as I'm on the planet. I mean, I'll, I'll, of course, yeah. yes. She's, I mean, she's business wise, you have to applaud her yeah. with Fenty, the yeah. makeup line, the yeah, Puma. This exactly. is beautiful. Have yeah. you tried it on? No, I haven't. I've, uh, no, I have to get on that. I can't wait to That's try right. the, well, you know, I'm not a makeup lover, but you yeah. know, I see things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's, think... supposedly it's very good. Yes, the, the, just the yeah. highlights, yes. The, like this yellow highlights. Yes. I don't know what it's called anyway. Yeah, it looks exactly. beautiful. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so I applaud her. Uh, I love your song, Rihanna, featuring DJ K Khalid and Pearson Tyler. Wow. Wild Thoughts. I play. Wow! I played that over <laughs> and over again. That's my song. And also, I really applaud her business-wise with the Puma again and the Fenty lines. And she, I mean, she's it's unstoppable. Edgy. Yes, edgy. exactly. She got, she has she's got so the much talent. Style. Yeah, the style. I, exactly. Look at her. There is no, no. She's no comparison. Alone. Yes, yes. yes. She's, she's alone in her lane. Yes, exactly. yes. So true. It's beautiful. So true. Anyways, on that last thing, don't forget Team Vladine. You can always find me on my website's website or also I am Vladine on Instagram and on Facebook Vladine. And to be Team Sophia Pauline Balouk, how do they get in touch with you? You get on my website or just Google um, Sophia Pauline Balouk .com or any social media platform. All right. Instagram and and etc everything social, Et social. <laughs> just google social. my name google my name last but not least namaste my loves namaste namaste namaste